What if I told you that by spending more money on your studio, you can actually save a lot of money by spending less? Let me explain. Whenever many people are first building up their studio, a lot of times they want to get equipment that fits on the level that they're at. So if they're a beginner, a lot of times they want to get beginner equipment. If they're intermediate, a lot of times they want to get intermediate equipment. And if they're advanced, then they're going to want to get more advanced equipment. But by going through all these different levels, you are actually wasting money. I have an example here that I'm going to be sharing with you that you can apply to anything else in your studio. So let's roll. I have six mic kits that I'm going to be sharing in this example today. So if you're starting to build up your studio and over time you want to upgrade slowly, this is the list that you may be looking at as well as pricing. Now all of these mic kits that I'm going to be sharing are a seven piece, which means kick drum, snare drum, three toms, and two overheads. There is one exception and it just has an extra overhead. So this is our list. First we have the Rockville Pro D7 coming in at about $194. Next we have the Samsung DK707, about $299. Next is the Audix FP7, which comes in at about $400. The Shure PGA at about $550. Now we have the Aventone Pro CDMK8, which is about $799. This is the drum mic kit with the extra overhead. And lastly, we have the SEV Pack Arena coming in at about $1,000. So let's say that your end goal is to get the SEV Pack Arena, but as you work your way up, you get each of these upgrading every time. Now, check this out. This is actually mind blowing. I did not think we'd be getting this number. If you add the cost together of each of the five drum mics, the five kids you'd be getting before the SEV Pack Arena, you would be spending over $2,000. By spending all that money, you could get two SEV Pack Arenas, or you could get a cheaper Earthworks microphone set. Earthworks are some of, if not the most used drum mic kits on the planet. And as I said in the intro, you can apply this to everything else in your studio. You can apply it to your acoustic treatment, to your laptop, to your interface. Look at how much money you'd actually spend if you took that time upgrading. And if this is something you're wanting to do going into the future, you're gonna end up with this higher end gear anyway. And you're gonna be getting better quality in your studio rather than if you just stuck with those cheaper drum mics. This will put you ahead of the game and give you better results. The question is, are you going to do it? Is that little bit of extra time saving up for the better equipment going to hold you back? We have used this tactic for our drums, cymbals, drum mic kit, laptop, and interface, and other things in our studio, and it has put us above many adults and people that are more experienced than us in our town. So once again, are you gonna do it? Let me know down in the comments below. If you enjoyed this video, please consider leaving a like and subscribing to our channel. We are gonna do everything we can to help you and your band and studio. So turn up the volume and rock on with Studio 612.